Hi guys, this is Prateek and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I will show you how to extract tables from scanned images with Python. Here I am referring to the tables that have rows and columns and generally used for displaying information. You can find them in invoices, newspapers, research papers, or books, etc. And table extraction is important because it allows us to convert data in physical documents or scanned images into digital form. And this digital information can be used for various other tasks. So I will use a fine-tuned Florence 2 model for this task of table extraction from images. If you want an introduction to Florence 2 model, then you can check out my other video. Just click on the I button appearing on top. In short, it is a vision foundation model from Microsoft that can perform multiple computer vision tasks in zero shot manner or right out of the box. And this model can also be fine tuned on custom data for any specific vision task. So as you can see right now, I have my Google Colab notebook. And over here, I have got my GPU enabled, right? You can run Florence 2 model on CPU as well, but it will be a little bit slower. So I recommend you use uh, a GPU. So to get started, we'll install these libraries. And then we'll import these modules. Next, we can load the Flowness 2 model. But before that, I'll have to add the model ID over here for the fine tuned Flowness 2 model. Okay, this is the model ID. And I will add the link to the page of this fine tuned model in the description section. Let's run the cell. All right, so we have imported the model. Now moving on. So over here we have a user defined function that will take a text prompt and an input image as inputs and perform table extraction with the help of Florence 2 model. It will send a combination of the coordinates of all those tables as output. Next, we have another function that will basically take the input image and the coordinates of the tables as input and create bonding box around those detected tables in the same image. Now let's pass some sample image and see how our fine-tuned Florence 2 model performs. Let me show you this image. Here you can see it's an image of a document that contains multiple tables. So over here we have the first table that contains around six columns and a few rows. Then at the bottom, we have another table, right? This table as well has the same structure. Now we will pass this image to our function that will use the Florence 2 model to extract these tables, basically extract the coordinates of these tables. So this is how you can do it. This first argument, this is basically the text prompt, okay? Here, OD simply means object detection. And this is our input image. Let's run this cell. So this took around three seconds because we are using GPU. If you are using CPU, this can take much longer than this. 
now what we'll do we will pass this output like this to our plot bonding box function we will also pass the input image okay so here you can see the same image but now we have the bonding box as well around our tables okay so you can see that this model is accurately identifying and detecting the tables in a scanned image now let's pass another scanned image right and this time it will have a different type of table let me put it in a different cell okay so this is the image and here we can see that we have a single table but a much larger table right so let's see whether uh, this fine tune florence 2 model can detect this or not so the process is again same we'll have to pass the text prompt right and the input image let's run this code so this model is doing pretty well on table detection right we provided it two different types of tables and it was able to successfully uh, detect both the tables now let's see how we can you know extract these tables into separate images from the input image so it's quite easy you just have to take the output of the model here you can see it's a dictionary the first uh, item is the coordinates right and the second item is the labels so we don't need labels right now so here what we can do can simply use the coordinates like this okay so these are the coordinates of the table and to extract or to crop out that table from the image we'll have to convert these coordinates into integers so for that we will use this code right and once we have the coordinates in integer form we can use the crop function of the pil library to perform cropping now let's display the cropped image i guess there is some error in our code all right so basically here i use the output of the first image let me change it to the output of the second image now again i'll run this code and there you go we have the entire table cropped out from the input image and you can also make adjustments in the coordinates like this right you can add and subtract values from the coordinates so you will be able to adjust the area that you want to crop from the input image let's say if i remove this thing then here you can see that the cropped image has shifted towards left right and if you subtract 10 points from the left coordinate then again the image will shift towards right 
like this you can do the same with the top coordinates and the bottom coordinates all right so if you want to extract tables from scanned images or scanned copies of documents you can definitely use florence to fine tune model so try it out with other type of documents you can also scan your own physical documents and put it as input to this model and see how it performs and let me know if you face any issues i'll be happy to help thank you